The Texas A&M Entomology Department is making this. It's its own honey, and it's now selling it to raise awareness of their research. They're improving the health and productivity of their honeybees and researching how pesticides affect the bees' lifespan. CAG's HD News reporter Chris Costa shows why these researchers say buying local honey like this is not only good for you, but can save you money in the long run. Most people are scared of bees, but not Juliana Rangel. Dr. Rangel is a professor of apiculture, the study of bees at Texas A&M. She's currently working on improving honeybee health and lifespan to make more productive and longer living bees. If we have healthy queens, we have healthy colonies that are very productive and give us the delicious Aggie honey that we're offering right now. Ron Hell and her team of researchers began selling their own Aggie honey on October 19th and were sold out in two days. Now they have more than 100 colonies, each with about 1,500 bees. And she says buying local honey is worth the difference in price. It is better than imported honey because you don't really know what kind of flowers the bees from that imported honey are um, foraging from. You're you know, buying from a local person who probably has higher integrity. You're often on a first name basis with them if you go to the farmer's market, so it's, you can just trust the product a lot more. According to Dr. Ron Hell, honeybees pollinate more than one third of the food that Americans eat, which means that her research and these bees are responsible for a lot more than just making good honey. Any kind of research that helps increase the health and productivity of honeybee colonies is research that will affect the average American family. Bringing the same health to families as she's bringing to the bees. Chris Costa, KAGS HD News.